Murray Fletcher Pratt was an American writer of science fiction, fantasy and history. He is best known for his works on naval history and on the American Civil War and for fiction written with L. Sprague de Camp, Life and Work. According to de Camp, Pratt was born near Tonawanda, New York, and attended Hobart College for one year. During the 1920s he worked for the Buffalo Courier Express and for a Staten Island newspaper. In 1926, he married Inga Stevens, an artist. In the late 1920s he began selling stories to pulp magazines. Again, according to de Camp's memoir, when a fire gutted his apartment in the 1930s he used the insurance money to study at the Sorbonne for a year. After that he began writing histories. Pratt was a military analyst for Time magazine, as well as a regular reviewer of historical non-fiction and fantasy and science fiction for the New York Times book review. Wargamers know Pratt as the inventor of a set of rules for naval wargaming before the Second World War. This was known as the, the Fletcher Pratt Naval War Game, and involved dozens of tiny wooden ships built on a scale of 1 inch to 50 feet. These were spread over the floor of Pratt's apartment and the maneuvers were calculated via a complex mathematical formula. Noted author and artist Jack Coggins was a frequent participant in Pratt's Navy game, and de Camp met him through his wargaming group. Pratt established the literary dining club known as the Trapdoor Spiders in 1944. The name is a reference to the exclusive habits of the trapdoor spider, which when it enters its burrow pulls the hatch shut behind it. The club was later fictionalized as the Black Widowers in a series of mystery stories by Isaac Asimov. Pratt himself was fictionalized in one story, to the barest, as the Widower's founder, Ralph Otter. He was also a charter member of the Civil War Round Table of New York, organized in 1951, and served as its president from 1953-1954. In 1956, after his death, the Round Table's board of directors established the Fletcher Pratt Award in his honor which is presented every May to the author or editor of the best non-fiction book on the Civil War published during the preceding calendar year. Aside from his historical writings, Pratt is best known for his fantasy collaborations with de Camp, the most famous of which is the humorous Harold Shea series, was eventually published in full as the complete complete enchanter. His solo fantasy novels The Well of the Unicorn and The Blue Star are also highly regarded. Pratt wrote in a markedly identifiable prose style, a reminiscent of the style of Bernard Devoto. One of his books is dedicated to Benny Devoto, who taught me to write. Several of Pratt's books were illustrated by Inga Stevens Pratt, his wife. Bibliography Novels Land of Unreason with L. Sprague de Camp The Carnelian Cube with L. Sprague de Camp The Well of the Unicorn the Blue Star, Double Jeopardy, The Undying Fire, Invaders from Rigel, Alien Planet, Series Harold Shea The Mathematics of Magic, The Enchanter Stories of L. Sprague de Camp and Fletcher Pratt with L. Sprague de Camp, The Complete Complete Enchanter with L. Sprague de Camp The Complete Enchanter with L. Sprague de Camp Asterisk The Incomplete Enchanter with L. Sprague de Camp Asterisk The Castle of Iron with L. Sprague de Camp Wall of Serpents Vermont The Enchanter Completed with L. Sprague de Camp Collections Double in Space Double Jeopardy Tales from Gavigan's Bar with L. Sprague de Camp Anthologies World of Wonder, Twain Triplets The Petrified Planet, which is 3. Non-fiction Fletcher Pratt Naval War Game A book on the Fletcher Pratt Naval War Game was printed in 2011. See Link, A Man and His Meals, World of Wonder, An Introduction to Imaginative Literature, Science All About Famous Inventors and Their Inventions, All About Rockets and Jets Illustrated by Jack Coggins. Rockets, Jets, Guided Missiles and Spaceships with Jack Coggins, By Spaceship to the Moon with Jack Coggins, Rockets, Satellites and Space Travel with Jack Coggins. 
History and Biography Naval History The Compact History of the United States Navy OCLC 367782 Empire and the Sea with Inga Stevens Fighting Ships of the U.S. Navy Illustrated by Jack Coggins Fleet Against Japan The Navy Has Wings The United States Naval Aviation The Navy A History The Story of a Service in Action the Navy's War, Night Work, The Story of Task Force 39 OCLC 1,492,544, Preble's Boys, Commodore Preble and the Birth of American Sea Power LCCN 501765, Sea Power in Today's War OCLC 1,450,484, Ships, Men, and Bases with Frank Knox, a Short History of the Army and Navy The Napoleonic Wars The Empire and the Glory Napoleon Bonaparte 1800-1806 Road to Empire The Life and Times of Bonaparte The General War of 1812 The Heroic Years 14 Years of the Republic 1801-1815 The Civil War The Civil War Civil War in Pictures Civil War on Western Waters the Military Genius of Abraham Lincoln, an essay with Colin R. Ballard, The Monitor and the Merrimack, Ordeal by Fire, An Informal History of the Civil War, Stanton, Lincoln's Secretary of War, World War II, America and Total War, The U.S. Army, A Guide to Its Men and Equipment with David Putty, What the Citizen Should Know About Modern War, the Marines' War, an account of the struggle for the Pacific from both American and Japanese sources. War for the World, a chronicle of our fighting forces in World War II. Other the cunning mulatto and other cases of Ellis Parker, American detective with Ellis Parker. Hail, Caesar. The Lost Battalion with Thomas M. Johnson. Muscle Power Artillery. The City of the Living Dead with Lawrence Manning, Secret and Urgent, The Story of Codes and Ciphers OCLC 795019, My Life to the Destroyers with L. A. Abercrombie, Eleven Generals, Studies in American Command, The Third King, The Battles That Changed History ISBN 0-486-41129-X.